Thank you for watching Capital Jazz TV. This is the 28th annual 2021 Capital Jazz Fest, and the Prince of Sophisticated Soul is here with us today, Mr. Yay. Will Downing. Yay. <laughs> Will, it is so good. And I told you this before the cameras that came on, but it's so good to see you here. It's good to see you as well. And no, we did not talk before we, we did not, came here. But we just the look. Yeah, she, we got the ensemble. I didn't want to show up by showing up my legs, so I just, <laughs> you know. <laughs> well, how have you been? How's I've it been, been going? I've been good, been busy working on good. new uh, albums. And, and I did say albums, I just, yes, plural. Yes. Uh, so, yeah, that's what I did during the pandemic, not a pandemic. Not I a call pandemic. it a pandemic. P damn it. The panini. The panini. <laughs> The pandemic. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, so you were you were feeding your soul by creating music during yeah. Panini. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I'm, I've been blessed to be able to put a studio in my home. Good. So during that time, I was recording. We were sending out files. We we're using the internet to the utmost. That's just right. sending out files back and forth, and That's Frankenstein right. and records together. That's right. Yeah. You had what was your first show? When was your first show after the Panini kind of slowed down a little? The first bit? show was Birmingham, Alabama. How'd you feel? It was, I was happy, I was excited, I was nervous, uh -huh. I felt like a new artist. Right. You know, like, and it was the most amazing feeling. You don't realize how much you miss what you do right. until it's taken away from you and then you get a chance to really do it again. That's right, yeah. because we, we're talking about artists who spend years on stage like yourself, mm -hmm. Mr. Will Downing, like always, I said Mr. Will Downing, That's all, all right. formal, That's Mr. Will Downing. <laughs> Who spend years on stage performing and it comes to a complete halt. Yeah, 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 it happens. It's life, mm -hmm. you know, and mm -hmm. we adjusted. No one knew what to do during this time, right. but somehow we all seem to have made it and, and here we are. I'm here with you. Right, at the Capital Burgundy. Jazz Fest, which I'm so happy <laughs> about and so, yes, I'm so happy about. So you've been working on music. You just released a new single. I did, I did. A song called The Warmth of You. Mm. So it's uh, for mm. my upcoming... 25th album. 25th album. 25th album coming out in November. So, yeah. Well, See, I ain't good looking and smart like you. So oh, this, oh. This, this is my only option. You know, <laughs> I, I have no other choice. This is it. <laughs> but you don't age a bit. When I say you don't age a bit, mm -hmm, you mm -hmm. like you got to give me the skin. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You've got to give mm -hmm, me the mm -hmm. skin. <laughs> hold on. Hold on. Right Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. She lies. Uh, what, what do you do? Like, soap and yeah, water. That's it. That's it. Soap and water and soap. sunshine. Let the sun. Let the sun, let the sun kiss you. your face, as I they know, say. That's right. Yeah. 25th album. How do you keep going for so long? Like, what is it about music? This is all I really know at this point. You know, this is all I've ever really done. Done. So, I just try to release music, and I try to do better than I did last time. Mm -hmm. So, there's an old saying that says, you know, try fail, try again, this time fail better. Right. So I'm trying to fail better right. <laughs> on, on this right. record. Right. And everyone knows you as a vocalist, songwriter, mm -hmm. but you're also a music ensemble selector DJ. Yeah, well. That's just putting out music for everyone else. Yeah, well, kind of I'm like DJ One Drop. <laughs> You know, it's like everything like right on I the beat. That. Yeah, I wait. Yeah, I, mean, I don't mix it up. It's like, boom, one drop. Just right on the beat. Uh, I have a radio show as well that I've been doing for quite some time, probably since 2008. Mm -hmm. It's called The Wind Down. Mm -hmm. So, you know, I've been doing that. It's a weekly show I've been doing since then. So, yeah, I do a little bit of everything. You got to be, you know, you got to get it in. You got to get it yeah. in. You got to keep it diversified. You gotta, Diversify. Well, she said that. Diversify. Diversify. <laughs> Diversify. <laughs> Is there a song on the wind down that you've played most recently that you said, I should have did that one? Oh, shoot. There, I hear songs every day that I go, I wish I'd have hit that one. <laughs> but um, there's actually, there's some artists that were on the festival today. Okay. Uh, the day that I'm doing it. Uh, Jared Lawson. Yes. Oh, my God. Amazing. Oh, my God. Amazing. Oh, my God. The future is definitely here. It's in good hands. Yeah, and in very good hands. It's in good yeah, hands. Yeah, so it, amazing music. So everyone that's here on the festival yeah. uh, for the weekend is amazing. Yeah. I want to talk about an artist that we, we both know we're paying tribute to today, Bill Withers. Oh, yeah. Bill Withers, such a significant artist mm -hmm. in our time. You were paying tribute to him today. What is, what did, who did Bill Withers, what did he mean to you? First of all, Bill was a friend, so I, you know, I, I, I knew him. Uh, right. Amazing writer, amazing man. Very mm. uh, gives you like, you know, wisdom. 
lots of wisdom. I was always trying to get him to get back on stage and to get back in the studio. And he's like, he said, man, I'm, I'm good. I said, well, what do you mean you're good, man? People want to hear you. He's like, I've done what I've done. He said, I'm in real estate. I do really well as far as real estate is concerned. That's he's, interesting. That's oh, what, yeah. That's what Bill converted. To. Like, he yeah. left the music industry and went into yeah. real estate. Yeah. Did not know that. Yeah. I keep learning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's pockets of L.A. that, you know, Bill owns or owned, you know, unbelievable. So he was always trying to get us to be a little bit more entrepreneurial. And what we were doing, don't just sing and dance and all that. There's more to this than just the music. You know, take care of some business as well. Wow. Yeah. And I covered one of his songs. Covered covered a few of his a songs. Few of so yeah. I put yeah. a couple of nickels in his pocket with grandma's hands and songs yes. like that. And yes. lean on me. So yeah. Yes. Yeah. Great yeah. man. Great man. Left us with a uh, a trove, a treasure trove of music. Mm -hmm. uh, and that's what you should want to aspire to be like him yeah. as a writer, performer. So he's someone to look up to. Absolutely. We were talking about, I was talking with Marcus Miller, we were talking about his stuttering. Marcus is all right. <laughs> he, he, he all right. He'll never be a great bass player or anything like that. <laughs> He's, he won't be a legend, but he all right. <laughs> he won't be a legend. He all right. If you like that sort of thing, talented guys. So, so you're talking to Marcus. Right? Yeah, so I'm talking to Marcus. <laughs> and Marcus, we were talking about him. I never knew Bill Withers stuttered. Mm -hmm. And that was something that he had to overcome. And I always, and I'm, I was just amazed by that story. I, I have one that rivals that one a little bit. Tell me, tell okay. me. So, and I wasn't there, but uh, he used to do jingles. And, you know, when, in his heyday, like when his records were used, they would call him to do jingles. And he was working with a friend of mine, a guy named Bernie Drayton in New York. Mm -hmm. And they called him to do this, you know, it was probably like a, a beer commercial back then. And Bill... Okay, all the producers who wrote the, the commercial spot came to the studio to hear their spot being sung by Bill Withers. So when wow. you do jingles and there's a bunch of writers on it, each one of them kind of like, you can tell the word that they wrote during the jingle because they push. Right. That's all they do. Right. So you say, uh, and the beer that you drank, can you say and a little louder? <laughs> you say, and the beer that, well, can you, and the next person, right. can you say the? Right. And so they kept doing that to Bill. And Bill was sitting in the studio, and he was like, oh, uh, uh, he was, you know, was getting a little antsy. He said, I, I gotta go to the bathroom. So he left, the, he left the booth, and he never came back. Right? <laughs> okay, so later, you know, they called him, and he was like, hey, man, I was getting nervous. All those people asking me to do stuff. And every time I'd sing the song, the key seemed to get higher and higher, and the room got, you know, smaller and smaller. Right, right. And then he came back when they were all gone. It was just him and my friend Bernie. And they recorded it, knocked it out first take. Right. So, yeah. Right. <laughs> the, Bill, I can Bill so with us. see that with Bill. I can so, and I don't know him personally, mm -hmm. but you could just tell from his spirit, like, that's, mm -hmm. that's Bill. Yep. Uh-huh. <laughs> that's Bill. Yep. And it was more colorful than that, but I can't tell the real colorful part of the story. But <laughs> we'll save that for the, the after the, the, hours. the people who wrote the commercial were. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Didn't, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, what's next for you? Outside the album that's being released in November, what else are you up to? Are you touring right now? What um, should we look for? Yeah, that's my, my, my mantra is, to record, promote, tour. It's always been my mantra when you know I've uh, done albums. So that's what we're doing. We're gonna release this record. We're gonna promote it. And we're gonna tour it. And 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 we can go to your website. Where do we go to get your touring information? Come to look, come to willdowning.com. <laughs> you can find out what I'm doing, what I'm not doing, where I'm going, where I ain't going. Uh, or you can come to the Prince of Sophisticated Soul if you want to uh, buy the music and support in that way. Okay, so yeah. we can go to the Prince of Sophisticated Soul. Right. Dot com. You, dot com or, you can, or come to willdowning.com. Or willdowning.com. And that will tell you where I'm going and all that fun stuff. Are you active on social media? Uh, not You're, as much not as, as much? I should be. Uh huh. Uh huh. But yeah, I'm, I'm active socially. Well, yeah. I'm, I'm here with you. <laughs> And you're in the media, so social media, there you go. <laughs> you can also follow him on Instagram. <laughs> I'm Will Downing 3 on Instagram. All right, Will Downing Singer on Facebook. Yes. All that fun stuff. Yes, yes. Will, it's such a pleasure to Thank see you, you here. Thank I you. cannot wait to hear this Bill Withers tribute it's and what be you're going to contribute to it. Uh, I'm just so happy you're here. And Thank I'm you. happy live music is still live. Amen. Amen. There we go. There, there we go. <laughs> Will Downing, your host, Jodine Dorsey. You're tuned into Capital Jazz TV.